Hello, my little genius friends. Welcome back to another episode of the Kids Corner Podcast. I'm your host, Miss Smith, and as always, I'm so happy you could join me for this episode. All right, friends, this week's book is called Pete the Cat and the Perfect Pizza Party by Kimberly and James Dean. Pete the Cat loves pizza. Pete the Cat loves parties too. Pete had an idea of what he could do. He would have the perfect pizza party. You are invited. Fun pizza, pizza party. Music, games, bring your swimsuit. Pete's friends all arrived. It was time to build the perfect pizza together. That would make the pizza even better. Pete thought the perfect pizza would be pepperoni with extra cheese. Mmm, I wonder if that's some of your favorite pizzas. Right, friends? You love pizza, some of you, I'm sure. And you also love parties, right? So a lot of us can relate to Pete the cat. It's a party, a party, a pepperoni pizza party. Pin the tail on the unicorn, but everyone did not agree. Callie said, Pepperoni would be just fine, but I really love pretzels on mine. Hmm, pretzels? Friends, have you ever had a pizza with pretzels on it? I've never had a pizza with pretzels on it. <laughs> Pete and the gang were puzzled. Pretzels? Hey, that's what I said. <laughs> well, that's something new. But maybe pretzels could be groovy too. Hmm. It's a party, a party, a pepperoni pretzel pizza party. <laughs> so every time a new ingredient is added, they sing about it. I wonder if you guys will be able to join in on the next one. Squirrel said, pepperoni and pretzels would be just fine but I really love pistachios on mine. Mm? Pistachios? That's a weird one, friends. But, hey, it might be good. Pete and the gang were puzzled. Pistachios? Well, that's something new, but maybe pistachios could be groovy too. It's a party. A party! Remember the ingredients so far? A pepperoni pretzel pistachio pizza party. <laughs> Let's try that one again. It's a party! A party! A pepperoni pretzel pistachio pizza party. <laughs> that one's a little harder because of all the P words. Grumpy Toad said, Pepperoni pretzels and pistachios would be just fine, but I really love pickles on mine. <laughs> pickles. Pete and the gang were puzzled. Pickles? Well, that's something new, but maybe pickles could be groovy too. <laughs> and now it's time to say the ingredients again. It's a party, a party, a pepperoni pretzel pistachio pickle pizza party. <laughs> it's getting harder, friends. I hope you can keep up. And remember to use your imagination. Although this will be on YouTube very soon. Gus said, and Gus is a duck. Gus said, Pepperoni, pretzels, pistachios, and pickles would be just fine. 
but I really love popcorn on mine. Popcorn? Wow, these ingredients are getting out of hand. <laughs> Pete and the gang were puzzled. Popcorn? Well, that's something new, but maybe popcorn could be groovy too. <laughs> Ready? It's a party, a party, a pepperoni, pretzel, pistachio, pickle, popcorn pizza party. Oh, wow. That's a lot of ingredients, huh, friends? Alligator said, Pepperoni, pretzels, pistachios, pickles, and popcorn would be just fine, but I really love papaya on mine. Wow. Now Pete and the gang Now Pete and the gang were really puzzled. Papaya? Well, that's something new, but maybe papaya could be groovy too. Wow. It's a party. A party. A pepperoni, pretzel, pistachio, pickle, popcorn papaya pizza party can you remember all of that friends let's try and say that again together ready it's a party a party a pepperoni pretzel pistachio pickle and remember the last two popcorn papaya pizza party very good friends Pete and the gang piled the pepperoni, pretzels, pistachios, pickles, popcorn, and papaya on top. The pizza was so high, they had to stop. Ding! The pizza was done. Trying something new might be fun. They all built up the courage to take a first bite. And the pepperoni, pretzel, pistachio, pickle, Popcorn papaya pizza was out of sight. Dynamite, just right. <laughs> In the end, the perfect pizza party is a pizza shared with friends. The end. Wow, friends, that was a great lesson, right? Because even though some of those ingredients are not normally ingredients we put on pizza, it was really about the experience with your friends, being able to do something fun together and enjoy it together, right? I think that was really the lesson about this book. I enjoyed that book, that was really good. Well, friends, that brings us to the end of season three. What a wonderful season, friends. I enjoyed that book too. It's about a pizza party, which means we just had a pizza party at the end of our season three, right? That was a great book. I enjoyed it and I hope you did too, especially because we're going to be taking a break. But that doesn't mean that you have to take a break from watching or listening to all the books that we've read. You can go through them again and you can go through the other seasons as well. There are books in season one and season two, as well as this season that you might love to reread or re-listen to again. Right, friends? Yeah, so make sure you do that. And just to tell you a little secret, the YouTube channel is finally up. That's right. I'm very excited to announce that because it's been such a long time coming, but we finally managed to get all the books together. Everything is not gonna be uploaded at one time. The next week, you're gonna see some books up there. And then in the coming days and weeks, you're gonna see more books uploaded from our season three, okay? So season three books are going to be up and you get to see all the different pictures that were in the book, in the books that we read. All right, friends? So make sure you get on YouTube. The channel is at Kids 
Corner Pod. All right. So when you go on YouTube, you can make sure you get mommy or daddy or a family member, a brother or sister to help you on YouTube to put in at Kids Corner Pod. Okay. So this is the Kids Corner Podcast, but you shorten the podcast to pod on YouTube and make sure you subscribe on YouTube and also on here. Okay, friends, so that when we come back for season four, you'll know as soon as we come back, when you subscribe and you click that notification bell, when we get back, whether it's on YouTube or it's on here, you'll know right away. And then you can join me in listening to some of the books that we're going to be reading. All right, friends. Well, it's been such a wonderful season with you. Thank you so much for joining me for another season of the Kids Corner Podcast. I love reading you these books and I look forward to reading them to you again in season four. But for now, Let's take a break, let's relax, and let's enjoy our summer. Okay, friends? So make sure you go on YouTube and subscribe to the kid, at Kids Corner Pod on YouTube and subscribe on here wherever you're listening to this podcast right now and click that notification bell. All right? And I'll see you in season four. Have a great summer. Bye-bye, friends. Mm-hmm.